This is a Windows Phone 7 app review of EasyTube, which is available in the marketplace free and ad-free until September 30th. Then there will be a paid version and an advertised version, so you should get downloading it right now if you want to get it for free without ads. So we've already reviewed this app before, but the developer actually updated it again and he fixed all the frame rate issues and any other issues with the app and now it runs a lot better so you can play videos in full screen HD and the frame rate is perfectly normal what it's supposed to be and the audio works perfectly fine on HTC devices and everything runs well on the HTC devices so the app works really well for viewing any YouTube videos and a cool thing is you can actually turn off the screen and still listen to the audio without actually watching the video. So you can save battery if you're watching a music video or something. And then you can go instantly back to the video. And there's a bunch of other options, like you can actually download clips. And just click download. And you can also look at the comments on the clip. Scroll through those, you can reply to comments, you can view the description. You can share it on Facebook, Twitter, or email. There's a bunch of options, and the video even plays in line there in the smaller view. You can also view related clips and clips that that author uploaded. So there's practically everything that you could want here. You can also look at your own account. You can view all the videos you uploaded and also your favorite videos that you have. And you can also download those clips and they'll be organized in your folder. And if you downloaded a music video, you can play just the audio right there. So then you can be listening to the audio with the screen off and using way less battery life. And another great feature about this app that really makes you want to download this, and I highly recommend it for everyone, is the ability to play on a remote screen, like on your computer. So if you just go into the settings and you enable the play videos on a remote display, all you have to do is set up your computer, which doesn't take much time at all. And then you can simply browse for a video here and click it. And it'll start playing on your computer in full screen. So that's a really great option. The developer is even releasing a Mango version soon, which isn't out yet because he's still testing it, but it will allow you to do even more things like you can access your downloaded videos and you can play them while multitasking like you can play the audio clip there and it'll start to play and you can do other things on your phone so it actually background plays so that's really great for any music videos that you download it also does have multitasking of course so it'll fast resume and another cool feature that's coming in the mango update is the ability to actually create your own videos. So you can upload your own videos by going to your My Videos section and you can record right from inside the app. And once you have something recorded, you can select what you want to upload and then it'll upload it to YouTube. And it, the quality, of course, depends on your camera and everything, but it uploads straight to your YouTube account and then you can watch the video whenever you want. So you can actually upload an event that's happening straight to YouTube right from your phone. Previously you couldn't do this before. So that's a really nice feature and overall the app has come a long ways and I highly recommend you find EasyTube in the marketplace for free. Download it before September 30th and then you get the ad free version and it's a great application for streaming videos to your computer and just watching videos and doing anything else you possibly could do on YouTube. Once again, you can find EasyTube in the marketplace for free.